Hi, my beautiful Pisces. What's up, you guys? Thank you guys so much for being patient with me. I love you guys so much. This is going to be your November 19, 2022 reading. So as you guys know, I am open for personal readings in the month of November, and I will be closing at the end of November. Thank you guys so much for everyone who has purchased a personal reading. Also, Pisces, thank you guys so much for joining the channel membership. I really appreciate it. It means so much to me. Pisces, this is going to be a daily reading, but you guys know that this could be a couple of days in advance or a couple of days behind, okay? This doesn't have to be what is actually going on in this energy on today. This could be something that could occur for you maybe five or four days, okay, later. So hopefully you hear this when you're intended to hear this, and hopefully it assists you in some way. So I want to go ahead and get straight into this reading, but do me a favor, you guys. Go ahead and hit that like button for me. I appreciate you. I love you. So Pisces, your coming out is someone who... Maybe it's like having a painful conversation. Um, something is being illuminated. I feel like there's something about secrets being revealed. Um, it may be some type of, this may be breaking your heart. Um, you may be really sensitive to uh, someone else's emotions and how this could affect their feelings. But it's, it does feel like something that is definitely weighing heavy on your heart. And you just, you you fear something. You fear being um, misunderstood. You fear something of that nature, right? It's like almost like you fear being misunderstood in a situation. So I do feel like you're there's some type of illumination. So you may be revealing something. There may be something that you're revealing to another person. There may be some type of secrets that you're revealing, or there may be something that's very painful that you may be revealing to this person. I feel like um, it's very painful for you to say. It's very painful for you to express. It's very painful you, for you to communicate to this person because I feel like this is a, this is something that could be like, it could like, what am I hearing? It could like open up old wounds in a sense. Um, but yeah, you're really, really, I want to say frightened, but you're really fearful of how this is going to affect someone's emotions and feelings or their feelings for you, their, their heart, you know, how their heart is going to feel about you um, after you kind of like, you know, it's like, you know, you're basically re revealing something or showing something to this person. And I feel like it's a it's a conversation that you may have had that it's almost like you're taking you're taking some type of ownership. You're taking ownership of what you may have said. You know, this this is like a three way conversation. There may have been multiple people involved. Um, you know, I feel like there is a lot of pain and sorrow, uh, heartbreak, and disappointment amongst all of you. So there may have been two or three people involved in this situation. There may have been a three-way conversation where you were communicating to someone else, um, and maybe this person was involved in that communication. And so I do feel like you're very fearful of exposing that or communicating that, but you want it. I'm hearing that you want this person to be the first one to hear from you, or you want to speak your part, speak from your heart, um, and you know that it may be something very painful for them to hear or something very painful for you. So, yeah, this is what I'm saying. So whoever's coming towards you, though, Pisces, I do feel like this person um, is very overly sensitive. So they may have um, they may have been. They, they're they getting to an energy. It's like they feel like it's not safe to you. You reveal something to this person and I feel like they may have not took it the way that you may have expected. I got I kind of get this energy where they they have grown overly sensitive to the, this person is overly sensitive. OK, to whatever it is that you are saying or what they're hearing, it's making them very sensitive, overly sensitive, um, very maybe overly emotional. And to the point where I feel like this person maybe has a very hard time expressing their feelings. I feel like whoever this person in your energy, they could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Pisces, Scorpio, or Cancer. But I do feel like this person has a hard time opening up their heart or expressing their emotions and feelings. So for them to hear this from you, it just really makes it difficult for this person uh, to feel like it's safe to express their emotions and feelings back to you. So this person is not expressing their feelings and they're like about the situation, about what you have uh, revealed. Um, and I feel like this person is trying to protect their emotions and feelings right now because they really have worked hard to get themselves to a certain place in their life 
where information like this or hearing a, some, something like this just no longer affects them anymore, right? I feel like it no longer affects them emotionally and mentally. So this person is like kind of like taken aback and there's a feeling of... <sighs> There's a feeling of like needing to protect myself, needing to protect, you know, my own emotions and feelings. Um, you know, it's something like that what this person is feeling. Like there's an energy of this person is safeguarding their their heart and they're saying, okay, um, I won't open up. I won't express my feelings anymore. I won't say anything else. So that's how they're taking this. Um, the advice that I have to give to you, my beautiful Pisces, the advice here, and I feel like that was what it was. You were very fearful of being misinterpreted, misin like, what is it? Misinterpreted. Like, in a sense, you were, you were, you may have been afraid that you're being misinterpreted or this person will misinterpret something here. <clears throat> there may be something here in regards to misinterpretation, but I do feel like Pisces that you do want something stable here with this person. You do want to come together with this person. You do want you know, um, stability, balance, common ground, you know, peace, you do, okay? Maybe some type of, like, celebration, reconciliation, coming together. It's like almost like I still want to be uh, in good standing with this person. I still want to be friends. I still want to be close with this person. And I feel like at this time, Spirit is just saying that, you know, the way that you come towards the situation is almost like they're also saying that you may need to let it go, I feel like the conversation is something that you may have needed to have and in and it's something where you need to push through. Okay? I do feel like in order for there to be stability in the near future, in order for there to be um closeness or a friendship or a close relationship, I feel like this is something that may have needed to be communicated, something that may have needed to be said. Um and I'm getting the energy where, you know, you're having to kind of push through that. So if there is a painful conversation that needs to be had, if there is something that needs to be communicated, I'm getting this energy where it's best to just do it now. It's just best to do it now. You know, put it all out there, put it on a table, get it all out there now. I do feel like this person will reach out and they will communicate and they will talk to you. But at this time, they're needing to process their own emotions and feelings um, about the situation, about what they have heard or what about what you may have revealed to them at this time. 